What the police found in his trunk was horrifying. Heather was a sex worker living in West Virginia, and on this night, she invited the wrong man into her house. On September of 2015, Neil Falls went to Heather's door, knocked on it, and came in holding her at gunpoint. He initially had her by the throat, but she managed to escape and run into the kitchen. She manages to break free of the strangulation, runs into the kitchen looking for anything to defend herself. She finds a rake and starts swinging it at him. He, holding her at gunpoint still, says, I'm going to jail for rape or for murder and it's your decision. Heather doesn't believe him and she keeps swinging the rake at him. So his critical error is he sets the gun down to try and grab the rake from her hands. It's at this point she pushes forward and she ends up managing to grab the gun. A struggle ensues and she pulls the trigger, shooting and killing Neil Falls. Then she immediately calls the police and that's when they make this horrifying discovery. In the back of his vehicle, they the police described what was a serial killer's kit of bleach, shovel, axe, machete, knives, and all sorts of things to hide and dispose of a body. In addition, he had a hit list of the other sex workers and women that he was going to be targeted, six other victims that he had planned out across the United States to track down and kill. After this discovery, they were able to see that he probably killed these other 10 women leading up to her and that she basically saved what could be six or even more women's lives by this struggle.